Assalamu alaikum. How are you everybody? Hope you are well. In this video, I'm gonna talk about one new machine which is KN95 semi-automatic horizontal cutting machine. Okay, so uh, the machine looks like this. So before starting, uh, let me show you what is included in the design file. The design file has 3D format. In this file, you will get a step file x underscore t file and uh, igs this file okay only three file in this uh, folder and then cad and pdf file so here you can see cad and pdf file then bill of materials bill of materials in excel bit format like this okay then cad CAD file and in this CAD file CAD folder there are 195 files okay so every part of this machine has details design in that folder so here is only KN95 I don't know what is inside so let's open one oh, here is the uh, mold the cutting unit cutting roller okay And the second one truth mold that means this is the main ultrasonic roller dc53 materials you can see ffp2 and c certified kn95 and when you use this kind of roller you will get the result printed on the mask okay, and uh, here you can see the nose bar automatic nose bar placement option here so you will you will get nose bar here okay here is pdf file total 203 pdf files are in this folder there are many pdf files looks like here so let's open some pdf files and see how does it looks like now here you can see the mold mold size the font size of ultrasonic machine wide 270 mm uh, long and wide is like uh, 25 and, and the height is 125 you can even use a little bit more higher mold uh, but it's okay the design is correct although exactly same as design and here are some other small parts of the machine uh, here you can see if you zoom in here you can see all details diameters dimensions are in English so I think any engineer can understand what is the meaning. Okay, so we are not gonna talk about the PDF. We are mainly interested on SolidWork file here. So I will go there. But before going there, let me show you some more file. Here are like DLC program, electric drawings. Let's open it. This one. Uh, let's open this one. I don't. Know. Here you can see Shin Jie PLC. This is Chinese Shin Jie PLC. You can use your own PLC system or you can buy a Chinese Shin Jie PLC from China and use in Shin. So now let's open a video, production video, and see. okay so now go back and open our main attraction uh, the solidwork 3d design file so the first one is 16.4 mb so here you can see the design uh, this machine has three part one part a nose bar injection unit second part the cutting third part so here you can see total six layers mask a material reactor here available so if i am um, disassemble this thing 
uh, you can see the ruler there is a box actually there is nothing in the box uh, but the roller has a small motor adjusted here so you in and you can see there is a small motor and there is a small pinion okay so this will help to push materials inside machine there is the pinion there is the motor okay there is the motor it's okay you got the basic idea about the material rack and uh, if we come here here you can see the control box there is touch screen dlc control box available and then there is a, a tension frame uh, the materials comes from this side and go by this way okay so this frame is like helping to keep the alignment so this roller is important then we have found uh, two roller this is the first two rollers and you can also buy this set of rollers from the market uh, let me zoom in a little bit more then you can see clearly here you can see they used several springs one piece here one piece here one piece is here okay so the purpose of using three spin in this side it will help to adjust the roller very perfectly okay and this will make the working process very smooth after that for that you can see uh, there are two normal roller they used here and connected uh, by roller frame and the bearing okay so that's it uh, this is pretty much like simple architecture then we come here in this part we can see there is mechanical robotic hand and by this robotic hand every second it is pushing uh, the nose bar inside the machine okay so this there is automatic nose bar injection system in this machine so if i rotate it a little bit will understand more okay so here you can see the uh, the rack this is actually the nose bar holder this is nose bar holder you can buy this kind of nose bar holder ready made from the market or even you can make it by based on this design okay so show you clearly okay so let's hide this part see what is inside this unit so here we can see very little movement in the effect then nose bar stator machine okay and uh, the there is a unit the main working principle of this unit is to make straight the nose bar okay your nose bar was in circular position and go through this roller and these several rollers make the nose bar straight okay then and then there is cutting unit there is two more roller and here is the cutting unit every second it is like moving and uh, the nose bar head is cutting okay nose bar, nose bar wire is cutting and go here and then the automatic robotic hand is pushing the nose bar second into the mask okay. Okay. so you got the main idea about this mechanism this is actually the nose bar injection system okay so let's go forward and see what is in the next step okay so here you can see main uh, main 
ultrasonic roller and the main working uh, work of this roller is to uh, give the shape of the mask okay after giving shape of the mask this roller cut the mask and this is like uh, the exit roller and the main work of this exit and brushing roller is just taking out the mask okay so uh, if we hide this roller we can see ultrasonic ceiling head just under the uh, roller and is just set from from below the table okay so normally 15k ultrasonic machine is used for 95 5 or 6 layer mask so that would, that is like a little bit more powerful than 20k that's why we are using 15k here is the cutting roller and the mechanism of cutting roller is like by hitting with another roller uh, it just cut the mask okay and here is the output exit and unbushing roller you can adjust every roller uh, by tuning this screw every screw has a spring you can see there are more spring dust in the ultrasonic roller and here are like uh, screw spring in, in this middle and the last roller spring position is here okay but in the ultrasonic ceiling roller the spring position is here it's two in this side and the two in that side so uh, that that's the main working process and put it like this Here you can see all gears there are actually not so many gears because this is like three sets of parts so and here is one premium is connected all are interconnected here you can see all are interconnected and those gears are connected by a belt okay connected by chain or belt whatever you can use it looks like it connected by chain you can you can use gear motor and here you can see the gear motor gear motor is also connected to the main main bar okay so if i zoom out stand what is the work of this bar so when this motor is moving this bar it is also moving this part this roller are synchronized working in synchronized way and this video roller is also moving at the same time in synchronized way because uh, every second it is pushing this part is pushing the ear nose bar so it needs the synchronization that's why it is synchronized like in this way okay so that's uh, pretty much about this machine if you are interested about this machine uh, you can contact me and let me tell you the big difference between this machine this is vertical cutting machine and in my previous video i have shown you the this is a horizontal cutting machine and in my previous video i have shown you before uh, the vertical cutting machine okay so the horizontal cutting machine it needs a little bit wider fabrics and the vertical cutting machine needs little the same fabrics as 100 it's like it's a surgical mask machine so that fabric size is the um, mask available easy to use because everybody is making surgical mask too so you can use the same fabric size this machine but this machine is also okay this is like a more stable version of the machine uh, you can choose either either this machine or that machine is total you okay so hope you can make the machine uh, from this design you can survive against covid 19 thank you very much for watching we will upload more interesting machine videos soon in channel so please do subscribe and support us and i uh, hope so see you again
Thank you very much. Allah Hafiz.